religion prohibited men wearing silk okay uh, and so they found a new way of weaving through satin weave where it was six up one down so the weft warp would be all cotton and the weft which remained on the surface was silk okay so what touched your skin was cotton and what what gave a sheen outside was silk this is a cotton here which touches the skin is cotton and the right side has silk so it has a shine and luster of silk It's yeah. little heavy in weight also. You see the weight? Oh wow! It's heavy, that's weight. quite heavy. Yeah. Okay. That's the mushroom fabric. So what are we very seeing here? Very peculiar about that fabric. What are the kind of uh, silks we are seeing here? There are many different silks. So mushroom is very popular here. Okay. And then there are different art silks, which are synthetics. Silk is just the namesake, but that's something if the common person doesn't know, can get cheated in pricing. So these are these are all ajrak prints like blocks. Yeah, ajrak blocks. And what speciality of ajrak blocks? How do you recommend what ajrak? So ajrak is a kind of uh, process. It requires good 13 to 18 steps to develop that print when you're using natural dyes. And uh, one of the visitors had worn that. Uh, Shawl when he came to visit the king, and the king was so lured with the shawl, so he kept saying that "Aaj ke din rakle idhar, aaj ke din rakle idhar, kal leke jana." And then in Kachhi it's called "Aaj rak." Ah, aaj no divas rak. As he could feel as it gets. And that it remained with him forever. He was so uh, fascinated by the prince. Nice. And then they developed the whole thing here. So "Aaj rak" is basically that. Otherwise, there's no other meaning. <laughs> That Bhuj is famous for. This is, This is one. The metalwork, metalwork. 